A U.S. citizen from Pakistan is scheduled to appear in federal court today, accused of trying to set off a car bomb in Times Square Saturday. Attorney General Eric Holder announced the arrest of Faisal Shahzad early Tuesday morning. But it's clear that the, the intent behind this terrorist act was to kill Americans. Holder says the 30-year-old Shahzad was identified by customs agents at JFK Airport in New York, then arrested as he tried to board a flight to Dubai. United States attorney's offices in Manhattan and Connecticut, along with the New York Police Department, have worked night and day to find out who was responsible for what would have been a deadly attack had it been successful. It was Saturday night when officials say Shahzad drove this 1993 Pathfinder full of explosives and parked it in Times Square. Authorities were made aware of the smoking SUV by an alert T-shirt vendor. We continue to gather leads in this investigation, and it's important that the American people remain vigilant. The SUV forced officials to shut down Times Square for 10 hours as they worked to disable the bomb. Eventually, authorities learned Shazad bought the SUV from a Connecticut man about three weeks ago, paying cash. Early Tuesday morning, the FBI executed a search warrant on what is believed to be Shazad's Connecticut home. The first mission of our search was to ensure the public safety as well as the safety of our law enforcement team. That is complete and the public is safe. Is safe. The Pakistani Taliban did claim responsibility for the attack over the weekend. It's unclear if Shahzad is connected to that terror group, although officials say he did recently return to the U.S. after five months in Pakistan. Ed Donahue, The Associated Press.